more damage, and the storms are impacting other parts of North Texas as well. Studio tonight. So with all of this, Brooke, we have seen flooding, we've seen power outages, and a little bit more than that. Too. Yeah, a little bit of everything, Doug. In fact, we have some really compelling images out of South Fort Worth. Take a look behind me. You can see this is the lobby over at Texas Health Hughley. We're told patients were not affected by this. Thankfully, crews they are working tonight to get this all cleaned up. Fort Worth Fire also had to respond to that same area for some high water rescues. Cars stuck in the flash flooding around the hospital there. We also saw reports of flooding up in Wise County. Take a look at this video. This is from Hannah Rust in Decatur. You can see just how high the water comes up on one of those vehicles there. We also had Mobile 11 Storm Chaser out and about this evening as well. I want to show you what it looked like along Highway 380 just to the east of Decatur. You can see the runoff there rushing into a field. And we also saw some stranded vehicles along the road, right along the roadsides near the highway there. You can see it's just a reminder never to drive into standing water like that. All it takes is six inches to reach the bottom of most cars, and that can cause it to stall and it can cause you to lose control. Looking now live at DFW. Airport. Good news, everything back up and running. But we did see ground stops today because of the weather. Ramps had to be closed down, and we are still seeing some delays. So if you do have a flight, be sure to check ahead of time with your airline. In terms of power outages, a little bit of good news here. Really, not a lot. These are the latest numbers from Encore. You can see Denton reporting the highest number, just over a thousand. 168 outages in Tarrant County, 943 there in Dallas County, 34 in Collin County. But a good news. With that, is you know, not as bad as it could have been. They're also warning you to stay away from any down lines or debris that you may run into if you are out this evening. Doug? Good look, Brooke. Thank you very much. We know the crews are going to get out there and get everything fixed as quickly as possible.